Hello and welcome back to Nico Gaming Live, bringing you Banished. All right, jumping right back into our wonderful city. We have a few things going on right away off the bat. Um, our tools are super low. Our one blacksmith is just having a hard time keeping up with the demand, and I think it's time to grow a little more. So we're going to jump right in here and we're going to go to uh, refine the resources. And we're going to need a blacksmith, a metalsmith. Uh, shapes using a range of hammers and tools, various kinds of wares needed to make homemade, oh no, that's homemade stuff. Metal casting, village blacksmith, nope, try again. Nope. Nope. Still not going there. Alright. I guess we'll just do two set blacksmith right here. We'll let our villagers go ahead and do that. We are low on our labor force right now. So we need to work on um, working on getting some houses here, but our first priority will be those tools. We just got another uh, laborer here and continuing to grow our workforce. We have a total of 77 people as of right now. Things that have been completed since we last talked was the foundry. The foundry basically smelts uh, items at an alarming rate and uh, just uses furnace fuel to get it done. And right now I have it just blowing through our iron reserve right now. All right, we received another laborer. So right now our iron ore is 326, which is awesome because we have 168 actual iron bars laying around. Our coal mine is looking a little scarce right now with 12% remaining and two more workers have joined the force. So our candle maker is trying to go as full speed as it can, uh, trying to get the beeswax from the apiary. We have the candlestick maker with the 48 uh, beeswax in it, just making candles as quick as it can. Uh oh. Black Lung inhaled because of too much thick smoke has killed a person at the kiln already. Ooh, oh, that's over here. No, no, yep, no, that's, that should be right. So our brick, our brick maker just killed somebody. Not good. All right, where are our people? Why are we not getting any building going on over here? Is everybody running around trying to get things done? Come on, we gotta get blacksmith going. Eight out of eight have been accomplished, and we are now delivering our first set of materials to get this building going. Hello, new Earl. You have joined our labor force. Yet again, tools are still getting scary on us. Our labor force is growing slowly. We have 38 stone in our stockpile. As you guys can tell, there's a couple people running around with question marks. These are our um, lumber uh, mill people that are just kind of helping out the village where they can until their job is needed again. We had to put that on a pause because it was just eating through our logs like crazy. So we might think about adding some more deep foresters kind of over here uh, to feed this beast of a machine. We have now a iron storage directly across from the smeltery, which is great. It is still telling me my tools are too low. Four out of 55 stone, we have 17 in stock. It means somebody has a bunch of stone on them. Still six laborers uh, plugging away here. We're going to come down here and we're going to do something crazy. We're going to say we need to collect stone. 
collect that stone and it looks like a lot of it was already collected prior but now we got all that going we have another baby born into our wonderful civilization we are 81 people deep and our labor force is growing even more we are up to eight laborers which is excellent because we're gonna need at least two to peel off almost immediately once these blacksmiths are done and open oh boy our tools have are getting even scary though I would like to do uh, maybe a steel or a carbon based uh, but that's that's gonna still be a little bit more until we can get more miners uh, doing some steel or some more coal over here so right now guys we're just waiting for our workforce to get out here and start harvesting as I can see down here there's a few of them already working and running around that means they are bringing up the stone slowly on these building perfect look at that 55 out of 55 now they just need to contact those builders to get over there immediately and build that building we have four out of four of our beautiful builders and it looks like we already got one on the scene and has left the scene actually we have another section of the blacksmith over here already waiting just for stone hopefully that uh, big area that we just said to quarry out will uh, deliver that stone to us we have nine laborers working hard on our beautiful, beautiful forest. Oop. My camera is going haywire. No. All right. Give me one second, guys. I gotta fix this crazy camera. Alrighty, guys. Getting right back into it. <laughs> I don't know what happened to that camera craziness, but we just lost a bunch of people to old age. One was a woodcutter, one was a hunter, and one was a stoneworker. Oh my golly gee, we have 17 people requesting new tools and our new blacksmith open our new blacksmith we need to tell you need to start making iron iron tools ASAP we have 40 out of 55 of that stone just created and we are still going steady lots of dry goods more people still requesting iron tools and that one blacksmith just not being able to keep up yet but with this second blacksmith can they keep up with the demand we can only find out shortly in our series guys at this time I just want to reach out to you and if you're enjoying this series hit the thumbs up button let me know what you think about it so far if you want to see uh, something different other than this uh, wonderful building game that we got going on, let me know down in the comments below, and um, we'll take a look at it. Right now, we're still waiting for this blacksmith to be over. It has completed all of its stone requirements. And we're just waiting for the builders to show up. Out of the four builders, only two can work on one project at a time. That's not good. Alright, we are 23 tools still being requested at this time. 24, we're crawling up there. This is not good, guys. Not good at all. 
The reason why, if uh, it, the tools, it takes them like three days longer to do a lot of things. And a great example here is we have our builder down here that's requesting some tools, but not making hardly any progress whatsoever on this building. Whatsoever. Hopefully the next few builders that come by can complete this. Oh, here's one right here. They have tools, and look at the progress that it's just blowing through. So it is a very big thing that we get this done. We're still doing great on our food. We are 13,000 stockpile of our food right now. So that is still great news to hear. We have two builders on this working as hard as they can and beautiful. The next blacksmith is up and running. Just looking at these upgrades here and possible future endeavors. Seeing what we can do. We got our cows down here going crazy. You know what? I think it's about time. I think we need to come over here and look at trading. Um, if I can ever find the trading button now. Markets and trade. Trading. I want a farm supplier, small seeds, animals, trading post. Perfect. So what we need to do is we need to put this out on the water. And find a suitable spot for it. I think we'll be right there. And we're going to start that up and get the mossy brick. Uh, that will become a um, trading dock that we can sell off for cows and everything or brand new seeds and kind of get our thriving population up and not just eat radishes all day. All right, we've gone from 30 tool requests down to 25. We are doing good right now. It looks like things are starting to catch up slowly though. Our stone piles are starting to um, pick up we're looking at possibly doing another round of houses next episode I think that we we could definitely do that next episode after we get all these tool crisis taken care of got a large amount of wood still coming in and stone and the iron as well beautiful we got a few builders heading out here and laborers to cut down the trees that need to be done and then remove them 60 stone that is needed all right we're still continuing waiting for these tools to come down but we are losing people still to old age we just lost a farmer and a stone cutter Holy cow, people are dying left and right. We are waiting on some more candles, it looks like. We definitely got a lot of logs coming in. Perfect. Um, let's create building supplies, homewares, and metals. Let's go ahead and create one of these. This is hopefully clear, clean this up just a bit, push the logs off to the, um, the mine. That is going to eat a nice chunk of our stone, yeah. Not good. We got another person though on our labor force, hello and welcome. Still going down on tools, but another person died. Salutes to the barkeeper. Earl has taken his place, though, and is doing well. Beekeeper, sorry, barkeeper. 
Hello and happy birthday to the newest heir of our wonderful city. Oh, change that up. You're supposed to be making iron, not iron ore. I see lots of tools here on the ground. Couple sets. This is good. Alright, another laborer has joined our force. Hello, laborer. Still working on him, getting supplies up. Can we get the candles to make this a new coal mine for us? We're still waiting on the beeswax from the apiary to fill this up. It's still taking a moment of its time, though. As I see, the material warehouse is building pretty rapidly. I am happy with this build so far. Twenty-four tools still. And let's go ahead and look at what our supplies would cost us. I think we can afford a building supply. Yep, we have four of our building supplies. We're going to need one for this storage. This storage is going to have to be emptied and go somewhere. Hopefully it will all find good homes. The material warehouse is up and running. But we're going to have to have some laborers. But we're going to upgrade that barn. Uh, the storage barn over here is actually kind of full. Uh-oh. I have tools laying around over here. Well, what the heck. We now went from 23 to 14 tools needed. 13 tools needed. Nope, back to 14. I wish they made their mind up. city is still doing very well. Let's go ahead and look for some storage for food based. Small barn. Can we find food? Cellars. Small food cellar. I don't need small, I need big. For food. Narrow food warehouse. Oh, what is... Oh, that's the old quarry. Aha. Well, I guess we'll do right here then. Line these up. Make a nice big, long food warehouse for this. So that way we can ship all this stuff over here and this one over to there. 7,385 food available for our population at this time. Guys, we're going to have to go ahead and call it here, actually, because we're working on just getting all this stuff put back together, and I think we can come back with next episode trying to fill up this stone, getting all these done all at the same time, and getting this new barn done. Next episode, what we want to work on, we want to work on getting a school system up and getting all of our houses upgraded to the next level. Come back here in a few days, and I will have that ready for you. Thanks again, guys, and remember, if you are new to my channel, hit that subscribe button for me, and there's a bell right next to it. it turns on notifications to let you know when I have new videos coming out.